Coming up next is uh, a definitely controversial act, uh, but I've got to say, he's the best blackface act I've ever seen. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to say, Banoffa Tangbe! <laughs> Not a racist. <laughs> I love you too. Uh, sorry, I didn't have a chance to shout before I came out, so. Blackface thing? No? <laughs> uh, so, a lot of the time people tell me that uh, I'm a little bit like whitewashed or something, and uh, it kind of worries me a little bit because, like, I'm afraid that, like, I'm afraid if I ever meet Eminem in person, like, how do I put this? Uh, I'm afraid that if we get too close, that we'll just attract and just like annihilate each other from existence. <laughs> and uh, you see, you see why I'm afraid. Though, right? um, <laughs> uh, my friends actually had a nickname for me in a in a secondary school. It's like it's it's it, it was it's, it was funny at the time, but it's kind of terrible. Then they called me a Kinder Egg. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably all those toys that put my ass, but. <laughs> <laughs> but it's probably because I'm, I'm actually from uh, Cambridge, and there's not me. There's not really a lot of uh, other black people around there. Like it's 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 genuinely quite bad. I was out with uh, I was out uh, at the shopping centre once with my mum, and I genuinely heard a little boy say to his mum, uh, "Mummy, what's wrong with that man's face?" <laughs> Bas well. It wasn't that bad, actually, because that was the day that I learned that the, there are about as many black people in Cambridgeshire as there are burn victims, so... <laughs> it's very informative. Always learning. It's good. Uh, I'm just gonna be very professional and read my notes. <laughs> uh, I actually uh, I stopped eating meat fairly recently. Uh, I'm a vegetarian, and I always get the same question from people. Like, they always ask me, Bonoffa, what was it like telling your parents you were gay? And <laughs> I haven't had sausage in a long time, so I don't even know why they're saying that kind of stuff. I also haven't fucked a lot of dudes very recently. Which is, uh, probably the main thing. <laughs> uh, I, uh, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a third year student here, I'm living on the high street at the minute, uh, and uh, there's quite a lot of takeaways and stuff up, there, up that end. And there's one in particular that I noticed recently, it's, uh, it's got a really weird name, it's called Legal Food. <laughs> like... <laughs> Now, I appreciate the sentiment that goes into them telling me that they're not going to go to prison by serving me, but... <laughs> but then again, it's like a Chinese, so they might have been going for regal. I'm not... I'm not really... <laughs> this is the part of the show that I take off my mask and reveal that I'm actually Chinese, so it's not racist. Stuck on very tight today. <laughs> uh, I've been doing some like uh, some some a lot of like budgeting recently. I found out that uh, a lot of my money is going out in like uh, in in buying new clothes because I'm always finding that my jeans are like always getting torn like around the crotch and it's, it's fucking terrible. Like it's all my money is going to this and uh, can't be surprised. You know what they say about black guys, right? <laughs> can't stop shopping at Primark. <laughs> Also, they got big cocks. <laughs> Thank you.